What is compelling you? What's motivating you? What's the propeller on your boat moving you forward in your life and in your faith? Paul is saying it's the love of Christ that's compelling his behaviors, his views, his actions, his prayers, his attitudes. For Christ's love compels us because we are convinced, that word also means persuaded, that one, Jesus, died for all, and therefore all died. And he died for all that those who live should no longer live for themselves, but for Jesus who died for them. Christ's love compels us. It's the fuel in my fuel tank. It's the purpose behind my actions. It's the motivation I'm compelled into my day by the love of Christ. And I'm persuaded of what he accomplished on the cross with his life, death, and resurrection, that I should no longer live for myself, but I should live for Christ. Paul was persuaded by the gospel of Jesus. And then he's saying, my life is no longer about me. I'm compelled to live for the ways of Jesus, the purposes of Jesus, with the power of Jesus. 